All right, Brian, thank you. So there is an event coming to the DIA that is hoping to give teachers a really nice night out. The Detroit Cultural Center and the DIA teaming up for the first ever Educators Night. Yeah, this has been a long time coming. We have Jason Gillespie, who's the Education Director at the DIA, and Anne-Marie Brucky from Midtown Detroit, who is putting together the exclusive teacher experience. Thank you both for being here with us. Thank you for having us. Why don't we just start with an overview? I mean, teachers are, are heroes. They're doing so much in the classroom and outside of the classroom as well. This is about them. Correct. We love our teachers at the Cultural Center. And so we're hosting our first Educators Night on Tuesday, okay. September 26, between the hours of 4.30 and 8 o'clock. And we have five different venues that are hosting organizations from all around the Metro Detroit. So the Detroit Historical Museum, the uh -huh. Michigan Science Center, the Wright Museum, the Carr Center, and the DIA will be hosting organizations sharing the best of their resources for teachers. So they have a one-stop shop to find out the best ways that they they can enrich their curriculum for this year. So basically inspiration in a, in a rolling kind of a strolling environment. Correct. Can I bring a glass of wine and walk around too? Well, there will be a cash bar at the DIA. Ooh, now more teachers right. are interested. Okay. <laughs> well, the second I saw colored pencils and some sheets of paper, you know I had to get started. Yeah. All right, so Jason, you've kind of brought this spread here. Give us one example of something that teachers can, can see and do while they're there. Yeah, so this is uh, one of our, our projects, one of our studio projects, where we're going to uh, invite the teachers to come in and make these travel journals. Oh. Um, these are put together using uh, the, the, this material or uh, other material as I, a cover. I've seen colored paper cards. I know, and the yeah. pencil crayons are sharpened right. so well. <laughs> yep. It's the details for me. It is. Exactly. <laughs> so you just fold the cover over, and then you take okay. the inside pages. Oh, I already and made them too big. This is the inside of, of the notebook of okay. the journal, and you fold it in half, and then you put it on the inside and you use the rubber band as the binding. And what's nice is you can write in here, you can take notes, you can use this for your uh, grocery list, yeah. and it's, um, it's, it's renewable. When you use the pages, you can just swap them out. And oh, this is a throwback okay. to a simpler time, it feels like. <laughs> you know, yeah. instead of swiping, we're literally flipping pages. Right, so. Priya's working on a mermaid over here. It is. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, give us just kind of, where did this idea come from? How did you decide to put this all together? So we've been all been working together for the last five years on the larger cultural center planning initiative, which we're looking at re-envisioning the public spaces in the district. Mm -hmm. But along with that, we're doing a lot of new collaborative programming together, where we work together on concert of colors, Noel Night, D-Electricity, uh, the new standard jazz series. But this is one way for us to give back to our teachers who are really important to us and in serving students within the district. What do you think about this unique collaboration to kind of bring this night for our teachers? Well, I think it's a really great opportunity for people to realize that there are more than one institution in this cultural center, that you yeah, can walk it, right. that you can go from venue to venue, that you could also possibly do field two field trips in yeah. one day. Yes, absolutely. Like a car show all in one, an art fair all in one, all this stuff. You can just roll around. Okay, before Guys, we go to break, this is so bad. I have to, everybody, hold Guys, up. I think that's pretty good. Okay, honestly, that is a my good mermaid skills used to be a lot better. Six-year-old Priya is really disappointed with herself. No, right six-year-old is very proud. Look at this, Wait, Priya. We, okay, let's. We don't need a close. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for being with us. And of course, all of this for our teachers. So thank you so much for putting it on. Thank, thank you. We'll be right back. Should I sign this? Yes. Download the 